Stay out of the camera. Stay out of the camera. Come on. Good girl. Yes, dogs will eat fucking bones. When they're wolves, they'll eat bones. You don't see wolves running around uh, fucking being taken to the ER for fucking stomach issues. That's because they fucking eat that shit on a regular. Regular basis. They chew bones for the marrow. They'll chew them into little pieces, and, and they don't care if they're shards. The fucking, the dogs will get past it. Trust me. They know dogs' systems are, are pretty intense. She's a good girl. She's being trained right now. But she's, uh, who knows, possibly fully trained for all you know. All right. Yeah, we're looking for the black void human android, humanoid android. The black void humanoid android, or possibly am animating in position when I fucking walked up on it. We're talking serious science fiction kind of shit, kind of. Fucking no question. That shit. Not kind of, but fully. Full fledged and one direction. Fucking that shit was unusual as hell. Beyond unusual. If it was a prank, it was a really good one. And if it turns out to be a prank, it'll be a still a real good one. Oh, here's that other path? Okay. I guess I took her off the main path and brought her on the higher path, which is where the creature was on the other side of this ravine. We'll get to you in a second. While, while we're at it, though, let's pan the sky. Always pan the sky and look behind you. Look in those woods. Make sure there ain't a motherfucker looking at you. All right, come on, guys. I mean, uh, guys, I'm talking about one dog here. Yeah, but maybe we're talking about me, too. All right, come on, guys. I'm not that kind of dog, guys. Oh, I got a clean record. Homeboy doesn't seek out fucking issues. Homeboy is not a fucking felon. Homeboy is not criminal. Uh, however, one day... I did literally get fucking, when I was a younger adult in jail a couple of times, not, you know, just a county, well, actually, it was just a fucking holding cell, but the guy that got a, you know, brutality by the police, and he's white, by the way, fully white, so white that you can see the fucking veins in his, oh, under his skin, oh, a white guy fucking bashed his chin into the ground. It was just all a misunderstanding. We were behind the 7-Eleven smoking weed. No big deal. We were in the 7-Eleven smoking weed. But, uh, you know, we were on their property, so they called. They thought, you know, they didn't know what's up. Heard noise in their bread rack room behind the store. Thought they were getting about to get, you know, who knows what. But it's all good. I mean, that was when I was a younger adult. But, yeah, it didn't take long to get that charge dropped immediately. Why? Because the friend they kicked into the ground that had the fucked up, uh, you know, the brutality from the cop, he ended up, he had a dad that was a fucking circuit judge, man. You know, he had a fucking dad was a judge. I don't even know what you call it. It was a top top dog kind of judge, you know, not a circuit judge. He was a top dog fucking whatever they call that shit. A serious judge, not a Supreme Court judge. Below that, but fucking... Anyway, the cops dropped that charge. Yeah, white privilege. What are you going to do? The fucking guy had a dad that was a judge. What are you going to do? Hey, it was a good thing, though. I got out of jail, and I didn't even get charged. They dropped all the charges once they found out that guy's dad was a fucking judge. Hilarious, isn't it? Yeah, good girl, Lassie. Good girl. All right, now let's keep our eyes out, Lassie. Because this is... Over this, it might have been uh, one more ravine, and that's where that fucking thing was. And it seemed like it was trying to tell me not to come up here. So I waited a couple days. Let's go. Because I, I was scared. I ain't gonna lie, I was scared. I wasn't heart pumping, adrenaline scared. I was just, couldn't explain it. Uh, warlocks do get scared. 
it's just a different kind of scared. It's like we have to figure shit out after that. Make sure it's clarified. And I tried to do it while I was sleeping last night, but I had other jobs, so I couldn't get to it. Apparently, it's not a concern, or my other warlocks would have told me about it. But sometimes shit gets under, or it gets past check, even on them. And then I have to take care of that shit, so. Because I'm an earthbound warlock, and they're orbital. They're outside the orbit of Earth. Not, when I say orbital, I just mean they're above us. They're like fucking angels. Uh, but they're above us. In every respect, they're not even... And they only come down to Earth once in a while. They got their own pads, their own fucking shit, their own cribs. <sighs> All right, Lassie, let's turn this.